Hey guys, it's Celeste with Lazy JX Ranch. Um, so I just got this Encourager. This is the new Happy Planner Girl. I just got this the other day and I I'm going to use this for work um, because I'm using the um, Empowered Women Planner um, for work right now and it is a lined vertical planner very beautiful planner but it just I've tried to make it as functional as I can um, this year but when I saw this and I was gonna because this um, empowered women um, planner expires in December so I was gonna just try and find another lined vertical because I didn't know what else to use for the for work um, but when they uh, came out with this uh, fitness layout in a functional form and non-fitness form, um, I was like, yes, this is exactly what I need for my work planner. Um, I was going to try and wait till January to use it, but I'm not going to. So I'm going to show you how I'm planning on using this in my catch-all planner. Um, so the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to leave this and I'm going to pull October, but I'm only going to use the guts out of October. Um, I'm not going to use the currently page and I'm not going to use the divider. Um, and I'm not going to use this part of the monthly. I'm just going to use the guts because, so I just pulled those out. Um, the reason I'm just going to use the guts is instead of redating the monthly planner and the currently page. So I just pulled the currently page out of the Empowered Women planner, um, the divider, which I really love this divider anyway, so it works, out of the Empowered Women and the monthly calendar. So this makes it so I don't have to redate the monthly view or um, redate the currently page. So I'm going to go ahead and put that into my catch-all planner. Just this section. Okay, so I already have a paper clip that I use in this planner. Um, so what I'm gonna do, as of right now, is just paper clip these two pages together. Okay, so when you open it, this is the only page you see without like gluing it and everything else. Um, and then I'm just gonna put, well actually, I need this divider in here. This is my divider for my work planner. So we'll just go ahead and put it in place right now. Okay, so these dates are obviously wrong, um, so I need to cover them up. Maybe I'll move this out of the way for now. We're just going to move it out of the way for now. So I have this washi, which is pink, which may not be my theme for the month, but it is breast cancer awareness. And I'm not going to white out anything because, frankly, I don't have any white out. I mean, I do, but it's, it dried out on me. So, and I have not been able to find the whiteout in like the Tombow, the whiteout tape um, at any of my local stores, um, which 
I say local stores, which means Walmart, because that's all I have available to me. So, I figured this would be okay. Um, this planner will be minimally decorated, if decorated at all. Um, it's more of a functional planner for me. Um, so I don't mind the pink throughout the whole month spread. And I'm just going to try it like this for October if I don't like it. Um, you know, as far as like the redating and everything goes, I can change it up. Um, I probably will end up buying another one of these layouts. So I'm not worried about missing October. Because I was just talking about it in my flip through video of like if I had two of these then I could um, start with it now and you know what I was just like you know what we're just gonna start with it and see if I like it um, I know I saw somebody using this as a social media planner and it would be a good one for that too so even if I don't end up using it for work um, this is a pretty functional layout so um, yeah even if I don't end up keeping it as a work planner I'm pretty sure I can find something useful for it I won't let it go to waste I don't believe in letting them go to waste even if I just use it for journaling pages so But if I like it, then I will definitely get a second one um, to replace the pages <laughs> that I'm using. We're almost done. Sorry, it's taking forever. If I can figure out how to speed this part up without speeding up the whole video, I will do that. <laughs> but I've not had any luck with it in the past. So you may just have to sit there and watch me go through each page. <laughs> Um, but anyways, I'm not a big fan of the dividers in this planner, so I don't feel bad about not using the dividers. Um, and honestly, I'm not a big fan of the currently page either, so I'm not upset about reusing the currently. So, okay, so October in 2019 starts on a Tuesday. So I have this that came with my um, extension pack, my dashboard extension pack. Um, so let's see here. I'm not sure if the purple will show through. I don't think it will. So I'm wondering either green or red. And it may just be like this. We can do it like that. Whoa! Except for it doesn't start on Tuesday. So we need 
need to move this sticker. Okay. So I'm okay with it being like that. Oh, hopefully I'm not blocking your view. If I am, I'm sorry. So there's three. Four. Five. That might be my oldest daughter. Or my husband. One of the two. Or it could just be they're barking at the wind. That's entirely possible, too. Okay, so there's that. And I think September has 30. So we could take this 30 right here and put it right there on Monday. Just so we have that notated. Um, so today's Saturday, so technically I would be starting this planner on Monday. I'm so excited. I was just so excited because I'm, my brain is just going crazy with all the ways that this layout is going to help me. So this is a time-consuming part, but I appreciate you being patient with me. Like I said, if I figure out how to speed up just the portion of the video, I will do that. Um, right now I use Google Photos to edit. Um, whoops. And um, an app called Splice. And then I upload straight from the YouTube app. So if you use something different, I would love to hear what you're using, what different apps you're using. Um, and I actually, I videotape upside down, and I videotape with my phone, um, just because, you know, we're YouTubing on a budget here. Um, and I'm able to flip the videos around using my Google Photos app. Um, And then um, if I had to split the video up, um, because I am using my phone, people call me um, in the middle of a video. And um, so I have to start over where um, I left off. And so I'll use um, the Splice app to merge the two or three videos together. So I would love to hear how you are doing it. Um, and like I said, I do do it on a budget um, because this is just for fun. And I already spend so much money on horses and planning supplies and rodeos, stuff like that, that um, it's just not uh, financially feasible for me to go out and buy, you know, a thousand dollar camera and all the editing software 
Um, okay, so October has 31 days. I need that because Halloween's on the 31st. So then this would be November right here. So we can do that in this red. How that wind is really howling outside. <laughs> okay. So there is that. Um, so here's how it's going to work. I need to put in that paper clip again. So I'll be able to start using this planner on Monday rather than waiting until um, the 1st of January to use it. Um, like I said, I was considering buying the another um, encourager planner anyway. So that way I would know for sure that I would have enough months. Um, but this is a great way for me to like play around with it and see if it's even going to work for me. Um, but yeah, so I just laid washi down. Well, actually, okay. So I used the currently out of my empowered women planner. I used the divider out of my empowered women planner and I used the monthly out of my empowered win women planner. And then I just used a paper clip right here to um, connect these two pages together so that it flowed seamlessly. Se seamlessly. Except for I think I'm going to move this. Maybe right there. Um, yeah, so all I did was laid some washi down here. I had some date dots from an undated planner that I had gotten. Um, and they kind of disappeared in this washi, so I just put them, put them here to the side, and I'm okay with that. So, that was super easy. Instead of redating everything um, or waiting, which was probably even more painful than redating everything, um, <laughs> here we have it. So I think it'll be totally functional for me. I'll just have to remember to either buy the October, November, December guts out of one or um, just invest in another planner. So, um, but that's okay. You know, honestly, I think I paid $10 for this Empowered Women because I got it kind of later on in the year. Um, and I've gotten more, I mean, it's more than paid for itself. So, um, and if I can use the rest of the dividers, which I actually, this planner really is a beautiful planner. Um, and I, I really enjoy it more than I enjoy the empowered women dividers. That's just me. Um, I'm not like normal people, I guess. Um, yeah, so. I think I can totally deal with it like this. Um, I'll probably, I have some double-sided tape somewhere, so I'll probably put a strip right here. But until I find it, um, instead of making you guys wait, I thought I'd hurry and throw this together um, so you can see how I'm going to be using the encourager for the rest of the year. Um, Here's my divider. And some of my notes that I like to keep in my page. So there you go. That's how I'm going to be using this planner this year. So um, for the rest of this year. So anyways, thank you guys so much for joining me. Um, if you liked this, please give me a thumbs up. Um, if you have a video of how you are using your 2020 planners now, please let us know below so that we can all go and watch your setup video. Um, you know, it just, it's helpful for the whole community, I think. Um, you know, that's why we're here. We're here to uh, learn from each other and to get ideas from each other. So this is how I have this set up for now. 
November might change. Um, I might go back to the Empowered Women. Um, but I'm excited to get to use this new layout. So give me a thumbs up. Please consider subscribing to my channel, hitting the notification bell so that you don't miss any of our videos. And if there's anything you would like to share, please, as long as it's respectful <laughs> and kind, please make sure you share it down below. Anyways, you guys have a beautiful, wonderful day. Bye.